With a name like The Assassin, I expected something a little bit more, uh, especially from the perspective, the tonnage of a medium mech with what it brings to the table. I think this is an interesting mech in that in the beginning, its role really isn't that apparent. It's got a mix of ranged weaponry, long range, medium to short and short range. And then building on that, if you can make it fit, in my opinion, a very specific role, this is where it it really shines on the tabletop. But of course, the question is, in that role, as a medium mech, is it worth it? Can we do something better for less battle value? So we start off with a mech that's pretty fast for medium mech. Good jump capability for medium mech. That's, that's a start. That's kind of standard on, on medium mechs. But it also utilizes a long-range 5-pack, a medium laser, and a short-range 2-pack. I, I wish that was a 4- or 6-pack, but I realize that we're looking at tonnage here. And uh, while medium mechs have the ability to mount more than one primary weapon or, or heavy weapons, we're, heavier weapons, we're still on a medium mech chassis. You're, you're spoiled when you're playing assault and heavy mechs all the time. So what role does the assassin have? How are we going to use it to assassinate? Well, against other media mechs, it's about equal or underpowered on there at long to medium range. Uh, going up against, say, a griffin, classic media mech, uh, a griffin is going to really hit it hard on the way in with that. Um, even something that's kind of a generalist mech like the Shadowhawk, it's going to put some hurt on it. Um, a Wolverine is going to put some hurt on it. So we're not engaging mediums to mediums. And this is, of course, discounting a, a lucky shot here and there. Where I find it excels, if we're going to assassinate anything, it's going to be a dedicated light mech hunter. It has the speed to stay in the same bracket. It has the long-range missiles to shoot at a light mech, which if we match the five versus light mech armor that's got some bite to it it also has the medium laser and the short range missiles if it can get into close work on there hunting down stuff like jenners hunting down stuff um that might be a little bit fast like a spider on there for whatever reason if you have to hunt it down that's where i see it working primarily as a light mech hunter where you can't afford to ignore that light mech either because it's outflanking or the mission goals. I also see it as a heavier recon mech where maybe you want to look at some hidden units. Maybe you want to try and run around the table, discover some hidden units and still have a little bit of bite to fire back, take shots of opportunity, yet at the same time be able to run away on there. It works well for that. It's not really a stand-and-fight mech. It's not really a mech that wants to engage other mechs. Is that worth the battle value? Um, from my perspective, that is how I would approach the Assassin.